What up, world? It's your man Jabari. You're checking out Hip Hop Game TV. Thanks a lot for checking out part one of my interview with Young Money. In part two, J Mills, Gutter Gutter, and my man Mac Main talk about the most important lesson they learned from the man himself, Lil Wayne. Let's check it out. Each of you, I'm sure you've learned a lot from Wayne, but uh, I want to, you know, get what's the most important lesson that you each have learned from seeing Wayne thus far? Shit, just work. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, we both artists. We both was had solo deals on Universal at the same time. Mm -hmm. So just me being an artist up there, my shit didn't really work to the capacity that his shit is working. Yeah. I just look at it like, damn, like why my, you know, why my shit didn't go like that, but he worked. Like I've seen him before the Carter Three, after the Carter Three, and right now to this day, he worked harder now than he did when I first came around before he sold a million records his first week. Mm -hmm. So if anything, it's just like that motivation just to go hard, like mm -hmm. no matter what, even if you get a million dollars, just go hard. Yeah, well, that's pretty much the same with me, the work I did. The grind, being in the studio all night, even though you're up for eight Grammys, like, you know? Yeah. That's the main thing with me, I just say the work I did. What you Same thing, like, that's, that's like, that's what we all look at. This nigga too, like, far as the working, man, he, he don't stop, like, he a studio rat. Like, nigga don't, he spend his whole day in the studio, you know what I mean? We, we right there with him, so it's like, you can't do nothing but, 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 but respect a nigga like that who gonna sit in that studio all day like that, man, and, and did the shit that he did and accomplished what he accomplished. His work ethic, man, that's all it is. How was, how was the chemistry between Young Money? That shit easy. <laughs> I ain't like, the mixtape, y'all ain't really had no songs yet. That's this fucking me up, because I know the songs that we sitting on right now. Yeah, like, you. Mac know all the songs that we sitting on. Like, he fight every day, you know what I'm saying, in the meetings yeah. and all that for the songs that we sitting on. But the mixtape shit is, like, really easy to us. Mm -hmm. Like, if you, if anybody know Mac, if they go back to, like, Freestyle 101, they know oh, yeah. like, that shit is easy. Like, Mac made for present, that shit is easy. If you know me, you know, like, all the Smack DVDs and that mixtape shit, shit is easy. If you know Gutter, you, like, you was listening to the squad. Yeah, yeah, You know, yeah. so if you really want to listen to it, we all spit. Like, fuck doing what we do with this Young Money shit. We all spit, so this shit come, shit really, I'm not even trying to brag, but this shit come easy. Mac gonna tell you the same thing. Is it, Gutter gonna tell you the same thing. Is it like thing. a competition in Gutter and Mac? Is it, do you feel like y'all kind of in competition when y'all get in the lab? It's this nigga over here to the left. This nigga <laughs> always wanted with me in that studio. Mills, but, but it be on some friendly shit though. Like, you know what I mean? Like we keep it honest with each other. Like we get with if we, if I get with him on the track, he gonna let me know I got with him on the track. Yeah, if he yeah. get with me on the track, I'm gonna let him know he got with me on the track. It just be friendly competition though. Well, well, just be having fun and shit. That's it. That's what it is. That's what it is. About about. Like, how much time do y'all actually spend together? You know what I'm saying? Like, is it just the, the when y'all are on the road or? <laughs> we live together. We live together. <laughs> stay in the crib together. Like, we got a condo together, man. That's what it like, is. Like, us three right here in streets. Like, we live together. Pop, pop, good. <laughs> That's what it is. Hey, how, do you think that adds to the chemistry? Y'all just being around each other yeah, all day? Y'all know get, each other like? We know each other. Like, yeah. Matt know me like the front and the back of his hand, like I know gutter like the front and back, man, like when you get to live with somebody, you get to see people lows, they highs, yeah. you get to see they goods, they bads, you get to see like the shit that's gonna make them a star, and the shit that you can point out and tell them why they not gonna be a star because of that shit. Mm -hmm. Like, I'm not gonna get into all our bad points and nothing like that, but it's just when you live together, that shit become more than music. Then when you get in the studio, that shit be fun. Like I don't watch Matt do a song for 15 minutes, like one take. Like Mac can tell you times where he just wake up and they I'm just believe. they not like and I'm just sitting and I'm just doing a bunch of shit going and it be times like I might be sleep. Gutter, you ready to leave? I right, let me just finish putting this verse. Wake up, gutter, you ready to leave? I right, let me just finish doing this. Yeah. So it's like different days you catch us in different modes, but if we take you to the studio, you ain't you ain't gonna believe what you listening to. Wow. And y'all know I pop a gang of shit and I brag, but I'm not even bragging right now. It's just we can let music speak for ourselves. <laughs>